Hi folks. We all know the hassles of going to the doctor's office and the bigger hassle of missing a doctor's appointment. However, today let's take a look at some body cam footage of a Karen who decides to miss her appointment and, well, escalate things badly. But before we start today's video, a big thank you to all of my new and current channel members and subscribers. Without your guys' continuous ongoing support, I couldn't keep the channel going, so I want to thank all of you from the bottom of my heart. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the page. Leave a like and a comment because it helps me with the algorithm. And if you can, please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, let's enjoy today's video. That call. Okay, what's going on? Um, because this young lady right here okay. will not leave the building. Okay. And she's been harassing the patients that was in here. And says that she's going to sit in the lobby until she sees the doctor. And the doctor has stated he cannot see her. Okay, okay. I have an appointment. Doesn't matter. This is a business. Okay, I would like to talk to the doctor. I can't, they, they don't have to, you don't have to see the doctor. I don't know if you're misunderstanding. Like the doctor has told his staff that. No, no, yeah. no, no. You missed your appointment. The no, doctor, I'm not missing nothing. I cannot explain it to you any other way. You, you have to leave. If you refuse to leave, then the law kicks in. It's a privately owned I want to give you your ID. Okay. I'm, give me your you card. need to walk outside. No. You need to walk wow. outside. This is all being recorded on body cam. I've asked you for 10 minutes to walk outside. Please walk outside. You're not allowed to be here, okay? Thank you. This is all being recorded. You, viola you violated the law three times. At this point, you have three different charges. You've resisted arrest by not listening to my commands. You've trespassed. How far do you want to take this? Okay. How far you would you like to take this? Because I'm going to the doctor. I told you to leave. No, give me no, give me go to doctor. It's a business. It's not a business. It's a look. It is a private Cleveland company. Cleveland. Cleveland Clinic, Indian River Hospital is a know? private business. The sheriff's deputy is correct. The Cleveland Clinic is one of the largest healthcare companies out there that have offices all over the country, most predominantly in the Ohio region, but they have them all over. And this woman is mostly incorrect. Now, if she was to go to an ER, they would be more than happy and obligated by law to treat her. But seeing as this is a private doctor's office, they do not have to see her. They do not have to accept her insurance. They actually can have her trespass legally. I want to talk to all the one of you. Okay, this is all being recorded, okay? I want, I There's want, my I name. If you'd like to write it down, you can write it down, yes, okay? You have, pen, you, can spend, down. you have to provide your own pen. Here's, I will let you borrow a pen. Okay. I, it's unusual. Go to doctor? Is there any give me go to doctor? They're the ones that called on you. No. She refused to leave for an hour. And got nasty with the staff. Listen, Michael Pierce. P I E I E R C E. You can just request a video because it's all been recorded since I got here. That's the easiest way to do it. Mm -hmm. You can put it on Facebook or Instagram or anything else. On it. See if they want to trespass. You can ask them. It was a department. Indian River County Sheriff's Office. But you're not free to leave yet, okay? So you're not allowed to go anywhere. Get her information for me. There you go. Now you'll do the same for him, right? Do you have a. Uh... So you're no okay, ID what card. crime is denying to me? What crime uh, so, I so we're going to issue what's called a trespass warning? If they want one. If they want one. <laughs> trespass warning. What is trespass I, warning? Therefore, I'm asking for your... Now, it just might be her accent, but she's starting to sound a lot like Mika Lova. And ma'am, a trespass warning is be given to you because you're in violation of Florida Law 810.08, trespassing, which states... Whomever, without being authorized, licensed, or invited, willfully enters or remains inside a structure or conveyance, having been authorized, licensed, or invited, is warned by the owner or leasee of the premises or by a person authorized by the owner or leasee to depart and refuse to do so, commit the offense of criminal trespass in a structure or conveyance. Since the staff has asked you to leave and they had to call law enforcement, and law enforcement is asking you to leave, you are in strict violation of this law. Your identification so that I can fill out the paperwork. Do you want her back here anymore? Um, we will have to speak to the doctor okay. to see if he is saying 
Yes or no. Okay. Um, so, yeah, could you ask? Do you have an ID card with you? What kind of trespass are trespassing? It's a, it's a, it's okay. a Cleveland clinic. They have a right, they have a right to deny you service. They have a right to ask you to leave, and therefore, they've asked you to leave, you refuse. Now, we are telling you you have to leave. I told her to leave twice, and she refused. Now becomes, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me, listen to me. Now it becomes criminal. If you refuse to give me your ID, you're going to go to jail. It's not a threat. It's just that's what's going to happen. And the business, we call this foreshadowing. Give me your ID. We can do the paperwork. You can walk away and leave, never come back. Or I'm going to I'm gonna put you in handcuffs. We're going to go to jail. Let me guess. And you're going to get you to give us her information. That's correct. I want to. So I'm going to let you. Let, I'm going to let you decide which one. One, one more second, ma'am. I'm going to do this as nice as possible because I don't want to see you ruin your day. I don't know if you're familiar with the law, and I think you're confused about doctor being a doctor. This is a business no different than Publix and the Chinese restaurant and the pizza place. They choose who they see. You made an appointment. They agreed to no, see. You. Finish. No. Let me fin you don't let me finish. They must do it any you Don't let me finish. Not choosing who they no, see that's not true. Hospital. Absolutely not true. This is not a hospital. This is this is a business. This is a off-site medical care. If you go to the emergency room, they have to see you. This is not the emergency room. So let me finish. This is a business. They've asked you to leave. The minute you did not leave the lobby on their request, you broke the law of trespassing. Then the ugly guy in the suit shows up that has the law to tell you to leave. I told you to leave. You refused. I had to put my hand on your shoulder, that which was recorded, and escort you gently out of the building. That act is called resisting arrest. You were given a lawful order to leave. You refuse. Now, you have two violations of the law. The third coming is he is telling you to produce your identification, which is a lawful command, and we have a right to do that. I do not want you to get in trouble. I'm trying to do everything. And the officer is correct yet again, because in the state of Florida, according to 901.36, it is a crime to provide false name or not to provide any name or date of birth to a law enforcement officer when you are under arrest or lawfully detained since she's being lawfully detained to give her a trespass uh notice and warning her failure to provide id or giving a false id or no id or date of birth at all would be grounds to have her arrested for refusing to provide id to law enforcement impossible to keep this to a peaceful resolution. They want to trust that? Thank you. They gotta get with the doctor. Okay. They're gonna do that now? Yes. Okay. Okay. So again, I understand your okay. frustration. I'm sorry. Owners is building David Kurt. The, the owner of the build I don't know who the owner of the building is. You have to look business. Owner is Cleveland Clinic, which is a national company that has hospitals all over the United States. He is not the so owner. I cannot talk to them. They don't have to let you. That's like going to Publix and demanding the manager, and then he says, I don't yes. want to talk to you. If you are going to Publix, the people doing something. You don't stuff, have to, though. I must talk to the manager. It's a rules. You're shenanigans. Na, 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 na. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. And we're calling shenanigans here because you do not have a right to speak to the manager. You don't have a right to speak to anybody at this situation other than the law enforcement officers there to deal with you. Because you were late for your appointment and you chose to be, well, belligerent and hostile to the other patrons there to see the doctor at this doctor's office, they have asked you to leave. And since you haven't, well, Karen, you get trespassed and you have to find a new doctor. Missing, you're not. You're not. It's a private business. You're missing the point. No. You are. You have a right to talk to a boss here because that's a government entity. This is a private business. They do not have to produce the boss. The boss can say, tell her to leave. I don't want to ever see her again. And that's what they have, that's what they have the right to do. So you're misunderstood slightly about how the business operates. So, again, I'm not, I'm not disagreeing that you're upset or that you didn't get seen or there's an issue, but the way you're handling it is not correct. And it's, you get you in trouble. What, what I doing? I would call, I would look into the Cleveland Clinic company online and ex get a supervisor of the business or a complaint. So what are you doing it? Then you give me the doctor? You would maybe give you a different doctor. Yes, send me to another location. Okay, give me doctor now. But he can't, I can't do that here. 
This is no, a... why am I supposed to see different doctor? I won't see this one. It's my doctor. I see him for two years. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. It doesn't do sound like he want? wants... I don't know that he wants to see you anymore. Okay, go ask him. Call. That's what they're doing. They're asking him, they're asking him if he wants to yes, see you. Doctor cannot see you. And our Karen is wrong again because this is a private doctor's office. If this was an ER, the ER doctors are obligated by law to treat her for getting any medical services at the ER. But, seeing as this is a private clinic, they can deny her services, just like any store can. She's not allowed back. She's not allowed back. T.W. Not yet. T.W. Want to grab one? Yeah, can you grab one? I don't have a problem. So they don't want to ever, you, you're See, not like ever come back here, here again. Come back here, you go to jail, okay? That's, that's the bottom line. And that doctor made that decision. Doctor made the decision? Yes. So that's something you'll have to take up with the Cleveland Clinic. You're supposed to be doing on a paper. You just say me on a voice. No, we're going to no, fill out a piece of paper, paper for The doctor's going to sign it. And okay, then doctor can sign it. Yep, oh. and then you'll get a copy, and then you can deal with Cleveland Clinic later on, okay? Okay, right. And the, the doctor will sign it? Okay. Gonna, um, I have to get my supervisor to let him know what all he needs. Okay. So then they're going to be able to. But well, we're going to have a form. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have a form, and okay. basically we just need him to sign it, and okay. that'll explain that she's not allowed to come back. Okay. She gets a copy, you get a copy, and then you guys can keep one and okay. follow it with your business. Okay. I would just ask that he's the one that signs okay. it. Okay. Yep. We're going to fill the paper out, and the doctor, the, your doctor, is going to sign the paper that indicates that you're trespassed and not allowed to come back here, and you will get a copy of that to take to whoever you'd like to file the complaint with. So, what crime I commit? Uh, trespassing. I have an appointment. I didn't like it. Okay, if you're gonna look. And? Listen to me, I'll explain it to you one more time. Trespassing, at, I at invited. The you were invited, and then they told you to leave and you refused. The statute says once your, your your invitation has been revoked, you must immediately exit the premises, which you did not. And when I told you to leave, you did not. You refused. That's she said I'm vacant on all appointments, senior. Okay, You're vacant. But then I came and, and told leave, you to and leave. And I call after. Why? Do you can control what doctor I'm going? You call to me and make me leave out of doctor? They what have the right talking? to do that. <laughs> Who? The business, you're looking at this. Doctor again. never know what I'm here. He did. He signed in the paper. No. He doesn't want you here. The doctor signed. Show me paper. You're going to have it here shortly. You're going to get a copy of it. Doctor, no, it's unusual. You know, if doctor no one see me, if I have an appointment, I can sue them. You know what I'm well, and, and that's perfectly fine. You can certainly it's try. perfectly fine. Sure. Yeah, but can... that's not a law enforcement thing. We don't do, yeah, we're just... we don't do lawsuits. What are you doing? Criminal, which is what you did. You broke the law. I broke in the law. Several by times. By going to that, what you do there? You hypnotizing heavy. I know about what you're doing. What am I doing? It's what you're doing. And I actually called the federal yesterday. Uh, Is there a go after you? And today, I be called to him again. He be called to me. He give you all your names for put to jail all corruption of police in their beach. Yes. Just for you know it. Okay. And when you, you make sure you get the make sure you get the video that make sure you get the video of you breaking the law when you refuse to leave and put that on there as well because you boom roasted you broke the law several times so that's not corruption I misunderstood what she was doing. she, 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 she said that we were uh, we're all she corrupt. understood perfectly oh, maybe you something's not understood he does we're corrupt okay you are you go into the doctor office and pushing me out. Oh, I didn't push you out. And sometimes they make me think what it's criminal in round doctor. Ma'am, may I? And these people too. I I won't know your name. May I interrupt Fritz for a second? Yeah, uh, go give me your name. It's my it's my right. Okay. You have the, you have a constitutional right to be a dumbass. Why don't you jump up on the stand? You and, have a con. And, this we'll woman at the lobby. I'm sorry. Name this woman at the lobby. Okay. Let me let me explain what was going to happen to you. Mm -hmm, you do this too. Okay, I don't know what to do now. I, I can explain what happened to you. You will be both on a federal prison. Whatever you say about me is, is your right. I'm here to protect this business that you violated the law in, and that, that's it. You can, you can threaten me. You can tell me whatever you like to tell me. It's irrelevant. 
your lack of knowledge of the law is, is your fault. Maybe you should go home and read about it and, and learn the law. Then you wouldn't think I was corrupt for doing my job. Boom. Roasted. You won't hear me see a doctor. I won't see doctor. I won't talk to the doctor. Go to the emergency room. I don't have the right to talk to this doctor anymore. You go to the emergency room. Okay, what? I want for doctor to say it to me. He's going to give you a piece of paper that says it. You don't have a right. I don't know who you think you're in charge of, but you don't have a right to make those requests. You don't. So it's funny, I whatever. Appointment for doctor. It he doesn't matter. He, he took it away to and he told you to leave. It. The doctor wants you gone. He doesn't want to see you anymore. I want for doctor to say it to me. He's giving you a piece of paper that says it. First of all, doctor don't have a right to say it. Okay? Absolutely, right? he does. Absolutely, Absolutely he does. Absolutely he does. Okay. Hi, this is a trespass warning, stating you're hereby notified that you're no longer authorized, licensed, or invited to enter or remain at the premises. You may be arrested or refused uh, to leave or return to the air at any time. Basically, long story short, the easiest so way is that you cannot come back to this property. If you do, you go to jail. That's the easiest way to So explain. what's the sign? Where? You sign it right here. Dr. David Hurst. Dr. David Hurst, that's the office phone number. David. He even gave me his business card. Okay. You can go in. Yeah, they've hurst. For my report, so I need it. Don't, don't snatch anything away from my hands. Don't try to be funny here. Okay, we're already cutting you a break as it is. So, you can do two of the things. You can sign it and get your copy, and then you can be on your way. You can sign it now, it's not him. This is David. Yes, it is. It's all on body camera. Are you going to refuse to sign this? Because if you refuse it, you're still trespassed. It doesn't mean anything. So when you come back here, you're gonna go to jail, okay? I'm just gonna write down refuse, okay? I'm gonna sign it, man. That's what you want for my sign. Okay, you don't have to sign it. You're still trespassed from here. If you come back, you go to jail. There you are. You're free to leave. You actually have to leave, so like you have to you leave. Need to leave. You don't leave. I have to leave. Yes. If you don't leave. You're going to jail. Yes. This is like your last and final warning. Okay. I know all the things. Have a better day. Well, that was uneventful. Maybe she learned her lesson. Or did she? I want to name this woman. Your your seconds from going to jail. I you, have want to name this woman you and I to... sue her. For this is what she's doing to me now. Me to it's me. my right. You cannot give me go inside, but you must go inside. No, I do not have to do that. No, I don't have to do that. No, I don't. No, it's my right. I, That's I, not important right now. Your it's important right no. now. Hire an attorney and sue them. No, you can hire an attorney. Call Cleveland Clinic. No. Oh, she hasn't gone inside yet. So I'm going to wait there. for her. I'm, I'm, I'm going to wait for him to show up. She hasn't gone inside yet. Okay, go into the moment. We are not going inside to get her name. It's not your right. Okay, you go. Yeah, it's my right. No, it's not. I know my right. No, you don't. United States. You wouldn't want to deprive me of my constitutional rights, would you, muscle head? <laughs> you don't know the law. Okay, how about I call 911 to say what you're doing? We are 911, so there you go. You call 911 for you that, you'll, like, you'll, you call 911 like you for call. that, you'll be abusing 911, you'll go to jail. I'd be abusing 911 Correct. to go to jail. Yep. I'm telling you right now, the best so thing for you to nice do is get in your car and go nice home. Or go up to nice Cleveland Clinic ER. That's what I'm telling you. I hey, beg so Olga, I Olga, Olga. I have all you now. I understand that. Okay. 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 Please go, okay. please go home. Okay. Please. I want to this woman. No. Pretty please, no. go home. Oh my gosh. Please, please go home. So no. you are kidnapping doctor right now? It's now you've caused the staff to lock the door because they feel lock threatened. The door. I don't know where she's getting her advice from, but these officers are right. This is her last chance. I mean, they've been so patient. She's literally been given every chance they can think of not to put her in cuffs and arrest her, but it just seems like she wants to go to jail. You need to leave. Please go home. Just go home. Absolutely not. Cleveland Clinic Cleveland will give them to you. I not sign it. Okay. I not sign it, you paper. You actually physically give me God or something. You're going to jail. This, is, this has gone far enough. Let's take her. That's it. Yep. Okay. Nope. 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 I nope. 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 Nope.
It was at this moment that she knew she fucked up. You're going to jail. You're going to jail. You have been given every right to not go you to have... jail. Don't resist me. Take my cut this way back. Ah, uh, honey. Let go of this. Worse than it really is. And we're going to end it here, folks. Our lovely Karen was charged with criminal trespassing and resisting without violence. There is no outcome of this court case at this time, but I'm willing to bet she was given probably probation and a small fine. So if you guys like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave a thumbs up and a comment because it helps with the algorithm. And if you can, please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, be well, be safe. And and a special thank you to all members of the news team. Without your guys' continuous ongoing support, I couldn't keep the channel going. So I want to thank all of you personally from the bottom of my heart.